All right. Wow, this is warm. It says it's 99 degrees. That's awesome. Um, so, uh, so we've got just three to baptize in this service. Um, at the next service, you be thankful you're not in the next service. We have 12 people to baptize in that one. <clears throat> so okay. Which is, which is great. It's just we'll, we'll be here for the long haul on that one. But uh, anyway, so we have three in this service. And, uh, you know, baptism is an opportunity for people to just outwardly profess their faith. It's a tangible way that we can show our faith in Jesus Christ. It's a tangible way of showing that we have committed our life and we are committing to transform our lives uh, in order to serve in his kingdom and to be a believer of Christ. And it's a, it's a very... Uh, celebratory thing. It's absolutely something we should celebrate, and so uh, we're excited to be able to baptize so many people today. Uh, Jesus himself modeled baptism. He got baptized by John the Baptist, even the Son of God himself. And he'd get baptized by immersion, so, uh, and he was baptized by John the Baptist. The Spirit of the Lord came upon him, and, uh, and also we, we read about uh, Philip and the Ethiopian, where the Ethiopian at that very moment, wanted to get baptized. And he said, is there anything from stopping me to do that? What, do, what are the requirements for me to be baptized? It's just to believe that, uh, that Jesus was the Son of God and to have a relationship with him. That is the only requirements for baptism. So, um, so we're going to invite the first person up here today. This is Matthew Grant. So come on up, Matthew. We have three, three people and three different people baptizing them. So we're, we're just doing all kinds of uh, switching around today. All right, so this is Matthew. It is. See, I'm told. It's warm. It's warm, yeah. So, Matthew, just uh, let us know, how long have you been coming here to New Hope? Uh, I think about four months now. Four months? But you've been here before. I was here back in 95. Okay. Yeah. So, it took uh, a while to come back. <laughs> well, I was in the military for 20 years and then got out and, and oh, came that's back. Oh, so. that's a good show. Yeah. <clears throat> right. Well, we thank you for your service. Which branch of the military were you? United States Coast Guard. Excellent. Good. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Um, so was there a time in your life when uh, you felt that, that that was the moment that you gave your life to Christ? That was the moment where things changed for you? I was a believer back in high school. Uh, went to Clovis High. Mm -hmm. Cougars. <laughs> uh, but my, my stepmother, who's actually now in hospital, uh, uh, gave a prayer with me back in 2001, August. Okay. And that was when I actually said it with my uh, Words, so. Excellent. Well, good. Well, that's why we're here today, to celebrate that and to uh, show everybody your beliefs. So just step forward in front of me. Put your hands up and tell your name. All right. It is my great pleasure, because of your profession of faith, as your brother in Christ, to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> My name is Pastor Beldheisen. I'm not a member of this congregation, but I've been a pastor longer than most of you have been alive. <laughs> and God has given me wonderful health, and I just rejoice that I can be with my brother in the Lord. And I'm going to ask him now to share a bit on how and when he became a Christian. I was uh, in an inner prison inside of the California Department of Corrections for nearly 40 years and uh, in the year 2000, November 23rd of 2000, uh, some bad stuff was going on. I asked God for help and he gave me help and I asked him to come into my life and Jesus Christ took over my life and he's walked with me ever since. Thank you. Okay, this baptism is going to be slightly different. There's no one way in the Bible to baptize people. We're going, he's going to go under the water three times. I baptize you in the name of the Father. Next time, have the Son. 
the next time of the Holy Spirit, okay? Okay, Mark, if you would go under. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Praise his holy name. And my brothers and sisters, the best is yet to come. Church, uh, good to see you. Uh, you just heard Mark talk about he lost a shoe, but the good news is he didn't lose his soul. All right. Uh, uh, that's what age does for you. Uh, this is this is really an exceptional morning for me. Um, uh, the first gentleman, Matthew, I, I knew him when he was a young man, and he still had lots of color in his hair and beard. He started attending here with his parents back in 1995, and so found his way back recently. And uh, Tustin, who's coming in right now, Tustin Cravey, he was here as a 12-year-old boy, and uh, as he shared with me on the uh, out, out front, found his way back a little while ago. I'm gonna get you over here on my left side. Here we go. And so this is kind of a, a fun day as prodigals find their way back. And so. Uh, tell me, how old were you when you invited Christ in your life? Uh, since I was a child in church. All right, so the impact of Sunday school, all right? It makes a difference. By the way, they could use a few more Sunday school teachers, okay? Think about it. You could do this. I'm confident. Um, when did you find your way back to New Hope? Uh, probably about seven months ago, six months ago. All right, so it's been exciting to have you back. And, Amen. Uh, you caught me off guard the first time I ran into your face out there because it was a little more mature than last time that I saw it. <laughs> yes. But uh, this is exciting to be able to share with you in this special moment, confirming that, uh, that moment in time when you gave it all up for Christ and you invited him to come live within your life. And you're making a public testimony to those who are here that Jesus Christ is preeminent in your life. So thank you for letting me share in that moment with you. Tustin, turn and face that way if you would. All right, great. Yeah, just like that. All right. Tustin, because of your profession of faith in Jesus Christ as your Savior and Lord, you are now my brother in Jesus Christ, and it's my joy and delight to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, so I'm going to get to baptisms now since we have so many, which is great. So if you are part of our student ministries um, and you are being baptized by Teddy today, come on up. And uh, I'd like you to stand in the front here so I can grill you for a very short period of time. <laughs> come on up. Where are you? Are they all outside? Okay. Well, that was organized. <laughs> all right, come on in. I'm going to, in actually, I'll have you introduce yourselves, and then I don't have to butcher your names. Huh? How far am I Oh, you're fine. You're good. Okay. Quick microphone thing. So we're going to uh, just have you uh, just uh, say your name and how long you've been coming to New Hope, and then I'll ask you some questions from there. We'll just start with you, and then we'll pass the mic down. But you, you're a little bit uh, past the student ministry phase now. A little but, past it, yeah. Right. So, <laughs> so just uh, give us your name and... and your association with New Hope. My name's Emily, and I've been coming to New Hope for like seven, eight years since high school, but I'm graduated college now, so. <laughs> All right. So just um, tell me about your relationship with Christ. Where did that begin? Is there a time in your life when you, when you knew that this was, 
the beginning of that? Uh, yeah, sophomore year in high school, I went to Wildwood, and that started my relationship with Wildwood. Christ. That's great. Yeah. So Wildwood, if you don't know, is part of Hume Christian Camp. So that's awesome. Pass along, Adeline. Hi, my name is Adeline. I've been coming to New Hope since seventh grade, and yeah. <laughs> and when when did you uh, give your life to Christ, or was there a moment when you knew that this was that everything has changed for you? Um, probably at Hume Lake Christian Camps in seventh grade. All right, great. Hume Lake's two for two right now. Okay. <laughs> My name's Haven. I've been coming to New Hope for a few months, and I think probably Heartland in sixth grade. Excellent. Good. Thank you. Um, my name is Isaiah, and I've been, I just started coming to New Hope. And your oh, I and then, faith uh, walk? Or? Yeah. Um, my friends, they brought me to Christ. They just, especially one of my friends, two of them, they're here. Right. Um, they just taught me everything about God, and I always wanted to just, you know, just be there, you know, just know that he's there. Great. That's excellent. See? Seeds that we plant in people's lives. Um, my name's Kenzie. I've been coming to New Hope for about two years now, I think. And I think the first major time I really accepted Jesus into my life was probably fourth grade. It was one of the first times I went to a big service with my family and not mm -hmm. just the kid one. My name's Toby. I've been coming to New Hope for about a year, and I came to God at New, uh, sorry, uh, Hume Lake Christian Camps. Okay, good. <laughs> Uh, my name is Rylan, and I've been coming to New Hope for about a year. What about your faith walk? How did that go? Uh, I've been believing in Christ for most of my life because my family believes in Christ. Right. So they brought me to Christ. Excellent. Hey, my name is Thomas, and I've been coming here for about three to four years. Um, semi-regularly and my faith journey well I, I've known uh, you know Christ all my life but it really started when I was about 13 years old and I picked up my mother's Bible and ever since then I was absolutely mystified by it and I, I haven't been able to put it down since Outstanding. See, just leave Bibles around the house that, sometimes that pays off yeah uh, my name is Denny and um, my husband Tyson, we've been coming here for 12 years now. Um, I've been blessed to have uh, been raised in a family that, of believers. My mom is back over there. Um, yeah, I've been blessed to, to do that. I think Christ really spoke to me through my children, our kids. Mm -hmm. And I think that that's when, um, you know, just it really kicked into full gear. Excellent. Thank you. My name is Tyson Lang. Um, we've been coming here again like about 12 years, and uh, I pretty much have her to, to thank for my walk. Um, she's really opened my eyes, uh, especially when, like she said, with the kids. Um, but uh, really just the changes that they've made in my life, and uh, it's just amazing. So it's about time. <laughs> <laughs> right. My name is Samuel, and I have been coming here for four years. And I wanted to be baptized in the summer. All right. Very good. Thank you very much, everybody. Thanks, Sam. Appreciate it. All right. If you guys want to go and head out there and get ready for get ready for baptism. Hey, Sam. Wave up, driving. Hello.
I'm going to do my best not to talk as much as Teddy talked in between <laughs> all of those. Uh, most of you, if you know Teddy, uh, you can't shut him up one-on-one, -on -one, all right? But uh, he doesn't like the public speaking for him. But let me tell you what, he pours his life into your kids, all right, uh, with all that he's got. And... Um, I, I, I get a little blessing. I get to do one of the high schoolers. So, Thomas, come on down. All right, tell everybody your name. Uh, my name's Thomas Sent. All right, and do you have any family out there? I'm going to take a guess real quick. That might be your mother yeah. right there in the front with the camera. Yeah. Is that right? Okay, all yeah. right, that's good. Mm -hmm. and, and you got dad out there too, I think? Uh, yeah, I believe wait, so. Wait, wait, oh, there he is. Uh, and grandma, is grandma back there? Yep, yeah, yeah, okay, uh, yeah. over there, yep, she's waving too. Oh, that is terrific, yeah. So, where do you go to school? I go to Sierra High. Sierra High, and I understand you even have Teddy's father-in-law sometimes as a teacher. Uh, yeah, that'd be Mr. Ashmore, I yeah. love that guy. Yeah, 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 we call him MD around here, and uh, he still subs up at Sierra High School, mm -hmm. so you're, you're blessed to have all kinds of good influence around you. Oh, yeah. So, I am so grateful you've invited Christ in your life, and thank you for giving me the privilege of sharing in this moment with you. Yeah, thank you. Why don't you turn that way, all right? Take your hands just like this. All right, perfect. Because of your profession of faith in Jesus Christ as your Savior and your, your Lord, you are now my brother in Christ. And so it is my delight and joy to baptize you, and I do so in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 God bless you. God bless you. Uh, thank you, sir. You they, uh, they allow me to feel young every once in a while, and sometimes I get to go to camp with them or to Mexico with them, and it's just an absolute... Come on, Samuel. Come down here. Now, this is the one who's the old guy in the group. All right, stay right there so everybody can see you. Tell them your name again. Samuel. Samuel, that's right. Samuel, you are bilingual, aren't you? Yes. Yeah, okay. You speak two languages. You speak English, and what else do you speak? Sign language. Sign language, that's right. Can you say hello and God bless you to everybody in sign language? Say hello and God bless you. Can you do that? <laughs> and 
how do you say God bless you? Can you do it? Look at mom. mom mom's going to show you. All right. Good job. Good job. Take one more step. I'm going to keep Samuel on a step so you can see his head for this, okay? Turn and face that way. Samuel, do your head just like I showed you. All right. Uh, Samuel, you invited Jesus Christ in your life when you were five, didn't you? Huh? Yeah, that's right. All right. And how old are you now? Six. Six. Uh, it is so much fun to share this moment with you. I invited Jesus in my life when I was five. We were the same age. That was just a couple of years ago. <laughs> but it is now my privilege to baptize you, Samuel. You are my brother in Jesus Christ. And I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Oh, today is so much fun around New Hope. We have our last two, all right? Eleven in this service, all right? And four or five in the other service. We have a husband and a wife coming in, the Lang family. And uh, the Lang family, actually, they got married here at New Hope several years ago. Their uncle married them, and then they started showing up here about 12 years ago, and it's hard for me to believe it's been that long. And I was always so envious of your husband's hair. He, uh, not, not now. I'm not, the way it looks now, I don't care. But when he first came, I was a 70s kid, and man, we wore it to the shoulders, and that's what he had that looked so good. But he's now setting some example for his kids or something. I don't know, but... Uh, what a pleasure it is to share in this moment with the two of you. You've already shared your salvation story with them. And so thank you for raising your kids now in a place where they can discover Jesus Christ as well. All right. So Danny, face that way. Raise your hand. Danny, because of your profession of faith in Jesus Christ as your Savior and Lord, we're part of the same family now. You are my sister. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yes. Stand right over there. No, she, she, well, being here with your husband yep. as well. All right. You taller than your wife. A little bit. <laughs> I haven't dropped anybody mm. yet. yet. <laughs> because of your profession of faith that Jesus Christ is your Savior and Lord, because He lives in your heart, we are joined together by His blood and we are brothers in His family. So I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. If that doesn't put you in a mood to worship, I don't know what will. <laughs> <laughs>